Well, first of all, we were sat down and given a brief. The brief was very short and we were just given the foundations of this concept. Everyone contributed and we made a fair bit of progress in the first week. We had to come up with one idea, so we sort of put a mix of everyone's ideas into one concept. We're like sort of trying to make like a sort of program that chooses like a random number between like one and eight and it chooses what division we're going to be put in. Next! Take a seat. Close your eyes. We're thinking they're kind of weird sort of characters like on the outside they're very bright and colourful and they look really excited and happy but then there's a bit more to them and they're a bit mysterious and so like behind the mask there's a bit of a different character to them. We had to think about like the backstory of what it was and what actually happened. I think it was the third week, we suddenly cracked the idea and we suddenly got it and we were all really excited. The box is a training ground divided into eight segments. One of the people in charge at the time of creating the bubble had felt that something wasn't right. It planted eight keys, one in each segment. People have been interacting with the keys, which is inspiring people, known as the disruptors, to take action and break out of the old system. It is your goal to bring all the keys together, burst the bubble and enter the outside world to create your own future. Sometimes I remember that day, all those years ago. I wake up, but there's a tight, uncomfortable knot in my stomach. Tomorrow, it's tomorrow, the day I enter the box. I had um, a vision of sort of maybe what the box looks like, how, what kind of atmosphere it is, and how it works. I feel that I've pushed myself, um, and I've done a lot more than I thought I would. It helped quite a bit with like getting my mind going with my um, drawings and other stuff. Three, two, one, go. I've stepped out of my comfort zone, but I've also played with my strengths using the computer. I've had to work with uh, the design groups on how the whole th aesthetics of the box and the bubble looks and what the outside world looks like. Take nine. Come in. Please take a seat. What's your name? Paulina. Okay, Paulina, today we're going to be talking to you about health regulation. This is the X point solution. It can only be used with neon formula. And this is the microfuser, and it cures cuts and scars. The xenotizer is charged with the spectrum. My mother told me a secret. What? About the eyes, the keys, and the box. The box is bad, the bubble's bad. I, okay. I, there's another world. The box is bad, the bubble's bad. So I don't know what you... You've got to believe they should be really bad! Outside bit is going to be the bubble, yeah. and then these little bits are like special towers. Like this is the main guard tower. These are all guard towers, and this is the, the unplaced balls. I enjoy being in the makery. I love just being set a task, so I can build stuff because I have the room and the space and the equipment. Mm -hmm. I don't usually work in game design, but I did work a little bit on making a kind of level where you, where you have to run from a boulder. It's extremely exciting and it, it kind of pushes the boundaries. Working with other people, I find it I don't know, I find it quite hard because it's two different people giving like separate opinions and you have to sort of find like the middle of what like we both agree with. <laughs> Go and I've worked on like the terrain outside the bubble and we need to work on like buildings and stuff. Uh, my role was 
being part of the coding design, so the um, the game aspect of it. This is Harry from Answered um, here at Exploring Today, and I will be showing off a kind of a little snippet of the of part of the box. This is the manufacturing kind of area. Um, so here they manufacture um, what's called the food pills, which are on these conveyor belts. As you can see now, um, these are your three, you know, essential foods for the day: your breakfast, you know, your lunch, your dinner. The main objective for this sort of you know, area is I need to find something that has something to do with eyes. We introduced the idea of the eyes quite late on in the project. My focus, I guess, was to draw the eyes and need to come up with what they actually would look like and how it would suit the whole narrative. They call me the crazy person. I see eyes watching us. There are keys. She told me. I know she did. I remember we were sat down at the old kitchen table. I looked up at her, my mother, her fair hair curling around her face. She wanted me to know something. Something about the box. Look out for the eyes. Find the keys. Reclaim your freedom. Never lose hope.